Hello and welcome to The Fort Report. I'm Alicia Woodruff. And I'm Chris Connolly. It's really hot, okay? I didn't say anything. I know you. Let's just do this. These lights are like five little suns. Whiner. Unlike my co-host, most Fort Worthians are of a more robust nature. Hey, I'm right here. There's still plenty of shade and cool refreshments at Rodeo Zone, now open in Stockyard Station. Guests of all ages will enjoy the lifelike robotic bull, bronc, and Texas Longhorn rides. You can also try your hand at roping in the arena, learn barrel racing techniques, experience real competitive rodeo on four large viewing screens, and even compete in the game of horseshoes. Where are you going to compete with that? Private rodeo schools and special event packages are available. For more information, visit StockyardStation.com. Not to be outdone by the Stockyards, the Museum District is hosting 50 Fest. It's a free community celebration of 50 years at the Amon Carter. Put the fan down. Art, bands, food, fun, free. That's really all you need to know, isn't it? Saturday, August 13th. You can find out more information at cartermuseum.org. We hate to close on a serious note. In fact, we aren't too fond of seriousness around here at all, but the extreme summer heat isn't just taking a toll on our citizens. It's seriously affecting local wildlife. Water sources at area parks have dried up. When this happens, our park residents, namely ducks and geese, usually fly to a more duck-friendly environment. Unfortunately, they are still hanging around. Why? Well, because people like to throw bread and crackers at them. The water's gone, but the food supply's still there. That is, as long as we keep feeding them. When they stick around, they are easy prey for urban foxes and bobcats, and they are also more prone to illness. So before you head to the pond with old hot dog buns or bread heels, remember that you're not helping the ducks. You might even be harming them. Yeah, kids, remember, a fed duck is a dead duck. That would look cool on a t-shirt. That's it for this week's Sport Report. Or a band name. We hate to close on a serious note. In fact, we aren't too fond of... <laughs> it's seriously affecting... <laughs> <laughs> so before you head to... The museum District is hosting 50 Fest. It's a 50... <laughs> <laughs> Art, band, food, fun, band. <laughs> <laughs>